Hey guys, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to create uh, invoice receipt uh, from vendor in SAP Fury. So normally we do this after you create a purchase order and you do the GRN for that particular purchase order. Then you have to create an invoice receipt for your vendor. In my previous videos, I have shown the, this previous step. Okay, now here I do the invoicing part only. So go to your SAP Fury window and log in, and there you can see a Fury tile called Create Supplier Invoice. Okay, so click on that. There, there. sometimes it will ask, uh, it will give a pop up to enter the company code, right? But here uh, it is not. Uh, pop up because uh, I'm not using this for the first time. If you're using this for the first time, it will pop up to enter the company code. So my company code is, you know, uh, US 000. Okay. And invoice date, you have to select invoice date. I'm going to select today's date. Okay. And then you have to select the amount that you're going to pay. Right. This should be matched with your PO value. Okay. And then make sure the input tax is selected. All right. And for the text field, you can enter the any text you want. So I'm going to in, add a reference. Okay. Zero zero five zero four. So don't worry about these things you can give any number you want okay this is just a reference number and i then i press enter okay now here go to the po reference and there you have to select your purchase order number if you know the purchase order number yes you can enter like this 53 right item 10 okay right great now you can see the purchase order number item and you can see the amount 3200 that's why i entered 3200 yeah also okay you have to uh, now enter the you have to check the quantity as well okay make sure you select all the data you check double check everything so after you are ready you can click the simulate option okay this will simulate and show you what are the entries the financial entries that you are going to that going to happen you can see here for the you know there is some GL account right so this is the vendor account so the vendor account minus 3200 uh, that means what credit right credit okay for the good receipt for the good receipt invoice receipt that will be debit 3200 okay and here you can select post right see it will share it will show and the invoice number is generated okay then uh, you can go to your purchase order number again and you can view what happened there to do that go to the home and go to my purchasing document item fury tire okay right so here you, you can enter your search time if you have any and you can press go and you can enter the this this one purchase orders it will show all the purchase orders okay from here you can find the 
Search is so there with jury free. Okay. So the my order is this one. Okay. Yeah. You can see the header detail, item detail, you're inside the purchase order number. I go back one time. I'll go again and I'll search like this. Okay. If I click on purchase orders, I can see here. And if I want to check the good receipt, I can see my good receipt. Supply invoices, I can see my supply invoices, right? Like this, all the details are there.